to play the pick'em challenge. Okay. Get five correct pick'em predictions for the challenger stage. Who is this team? Who is that team? Who the fuck is that team? Who's gonna go 3-0? Now remember, chat, when you're picking a team that's that's gonna go 3-0, you don't pick a team that's the you don't you never pick an obvious pit team that will obviously make it. You try to pick the team that's going to be, that could go 3-0, but might not even make make it to advance. You know what I'm saying? So in this scenario, you wouldn't put Vitality in 3-0. I think Furia and Mouse are for sure going to make it in. Like, you'd go like... Ince will probably make it, right? Ince is good, right? Razors? Who's on it's? Wow, Moo. Real DM, you here? Wow, Moo, thank you so much for your 3k bits, man. Thank you, dude. Who's on North? Like, I don't even know who who's on North. Who's on North, chat? User joined your channel. Balde, Kirby, Jugi. Oh, they're good, though. North is good though. Who's on ints? Who's on ints? User left your channel. It's like Henny, right? Henny, Phelps. Didn't K and G get picked up by Mib? Or something? Yell, Destiny, Cello. That's ints, right? Oh no, that's LG. That's LG. Who the fuck is on ints? I thought K and G was. Not on this team anymore. Hello, yell, Destiny, Zan, KNG. No, you, chat, man, you do not want to pick the obvious 3 0. You do not want to pick the obvious 3 0. I'm going to put Greyhound as a 3 0 3. G2 is an obvious 3 0 pick. Like, G, you don't want to pick a team that's going to obviously make it through. You don't pick a team that's obviously going to make it through. Fury is going to go through. Mouse is going to go through. Yeah. Okay, the reason why you don't want to pick a team that's going to obviously make it through for the 3-0 is because you get the same amount of points for a 3-0 pick than you do a team going through pick. So, say I put Fury... Say I, okay, just say, it, for example, I put Fury as my 3-0 pick and then they go 2-1 and one and they make it through. Well, I just wasted my 3-0 pick when I know that they're going to go through no matter what, but I don't get that obvious point. Know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, so, like, so you want to pick a 3-0 that, you know, is questionable, but in reality, a lot of these teams are able to beat each other on any, you know, if they're playing well, a lot of these people can, you know, 3-0. Anything can happen. Exactly. Anything can really happen in this. What? What? Who? We'll see there, Rod, Roddy. We'll see there, bud. User Hellraiser is a good team, man. Those guys are a good team. Are they? Are you guys actually thinking they're not good anymore? Like, all those players are nuts. I don't know. You think Simon and Dream Eaters are worse than Greyhound? I'm going to keep Hellraisers in here. I'm going to keep this. Like, I don't think... Maybe if you guys think this crazy team is really good, maybe they'll go 3-0 then. And I honestly do think Complexity will make... I think... Oh man, I think complexity will make it through this. I think complexity is honestly. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put complexity in this. I don't think. I think they'll make it through. Complexity is a better team than a lot of the. I think complexity will beat Furia. I don't think they're better than G2 or Vitality or Mouse, but I think they'd beat. Maybe. Guys, remember this is a challenger stage. This isn't a group stage. Look at these teams, chat. Like these teams are are not. Like. But I, you guys are telling me this fours team is really good too. Fours. You think a Vanguard and fours are better than Complexity? No, see, they we don't know who plays who first, right? Until a little, little, right? Hmm. I don't know. I think Complexity is. I don't know, man. Complexity is Shazam, Stan, Def, Sick. And Oboe. Hmm. 
Hellraiser's always does good, though, in groups. Or not stand, sorry. Um... Who the fuck is on complexity? They're such a wild card. Like, you have no fucking idea how they're gonna do. You have no idea how they're gonna do. You know what I mean? Like, no one has any idea how complexity is gonna... <laughs> I think Hellraiser's always does good. Oops, that's not Hellraiser's. Please remove Greyhound from 03. Greyhound are actually good. How sure are you of that? They do. Hellraiser's always somehow manages to get their way into group stage at least. They always slime their way in. Somehow, some way. That was with or without Woxic. That was before Woxic. Hell's Hellraiser's always somehow make it in. Some way. Somehow. I think these are the picks I'm going with. I don't know why crazy. Because you guys have told me that crazy is good. See, okay, I'll explain this for the last time, chat. I'll explain this for the last time. Here's my tip of the day. My tip. This is the JR tip for the pickums. All right? Are you ready? <sighs> you do not. For the 3 0 spot. You never want to pick a team that will obviously make it through to the group stage. And here is why. You get the same amount of points whether you get the 3-0 spot right or the advanced spot right. So whether you put, you know, for example, Furia in this spot... They make it through, no, and but they go two and one. Well, you just wasted the obvious team that's gonna make it through to the three, and you put them on the three zero spot, and now you get no points for a team that was obviously gonna make it through. You understand? Or whatever it was, yeah. All right. With the 3 0 spot, you always have to kind of risk it on a team that most likely won't go 3 0, but has that, that small chance, that small chance that will either not go 3 0 or not even make it at all. Like Vitality will most likely go 3 0. Like, I'm not saying they're not going to go 3 0. I'm saying, like, even Mouse Sports, those te these teams could obviously go 3 0, but. They're obviously going to, if they don't go 3 0, they're going to make it through no matter what. So why would I put them in the 3-0 spot when I know I when I guarantee myself a point in the advancement? Tyloo 3 0 would be like decent too, because Tyloo are really good and really random. I don't know. I think this is the picks, boys. I think these are them. I think maybe replacing, like, the only team that I would really feel comfortable... Like, I would either replace this or Hellraisers. Like, these two here. Yeah, like, maybe Ints. Like, Ints is really good. Really skilled. They could go 3 2 Like, we don't really... We don't know. Like, those players on Ints can pop off at any moment. Yell is a god. KNG, god. Ah, oh, man, Ince, I don't know. I'm confused why people think Ince is bad. Those players are really good. Jason R is the epitome of NACS. Yeah, yeah. And then I went to Summit and IGL'd and kicked them out of the fucking playoffs. Yeah, what's up? Yeah, what's up? Uh, my first tournament, IGLing. My first tournament, IGLing. So what if I did this? Remember when I chose Renegades to go 3-0 when everyone was making fun of me? Remember that, chat? <laughs> All you guys were making fun of me. Remember? Remember? And then they ended up going 3-0. And where were you guys at then? Yeah, I don't know. I think this is... Ints? See, KNG... Isn't KNG getting picked up by Made in Brazil? They're getting picked up by MIB, correct? KNG is getting picked up by MIB. Yeah. 
I think this is it. Is this it? Is this it, boys? What is their logo? That's a cool logo. Done. Locked in. Fucking lock the fuck in. Locked in, boys. Locked in. What the fuck, Eptima? You're on fucking. You're on. You're on crack, bro. You're on fucking. You're on crack. Alright, locked in, boys. Fucking lock the fuck in.